What's going on everyone? What is poppin'? I am back on Showdown today for some nice and clean OU content. And uh, today's team is going to be featuring a flip turn King Jarain team. Uh, before we get into it though, please leave a comment and uh, tell me if you could change something in Pokemon, what would you change? Uh, so for me, like I would want to change the timers in Wi-Fi battle so that it'd be longer for single battles and also maybe make more of the useless moves more useful, like how they change teleport uh, in this gen. And I would like for them to change happy hour, you know, if I'm trying to sell or, or celebrate, if they're trying to celebrate me, like drop me a full restore or something, <laughs> please. Uh, but I was kind of curious. So yeah, let me know. I, I look forward to reading them all. Now, as you can see, we have a Kingdra rain team and uh, I wanted to build one around it because, you know, Kingdra is back from the DLC. It's uh, It was not there before. It gets two new moves that it can really utilize well. Hurricane, which can break through uh, Amoongus and Tangrowth and stuff. And Flip Turn, which is a momentum move. So if they have Chansey that they can go into, we can Flip Turn out into something like Crawdont. And um, both of them play like each of the attacking sides. This one's more special attack. This one's more physical attack. And uh, then we have Pelipper to power up their moves. And I think it's really nice because Crawdont can break through fatter teams really well. While Kingdra can... Uh, easily uh, sweep through offense just by clicking like surf in the rain or something um, so i think both of them go really well together and then we have of course drizzle pelipper with defog uh, then we have uh, magirna av which is nice because it can give us momentum because as you can see we have flip turn u-turn and vol switch so we got the momentum uh, trio right there uh, amoongus is nice because it helps us versus the um urshifu rapid strike and zero aura and then finally, Como, -O, which is there for Stealth Rocks and a great Pokemon to deal with, a Bisharp and some other kinds of offenses that um, could be good for us there. I was running Toxic before, but I might just go back to Iron Defense or I might switch back and forth maybe. But I, I do like Iron Defense still. But let's go ahead and find a game and see how we do. Um, yeah, like I said, I mean, it's a pretty fun team. And uh, we got our first game here. And as you can see, we have uh, a team that actually um, looks a little bit weak to Kingdra for sure. I think we can kind of play around that a bit. Uh, I might just lead, yeah, Pelipper here to get the rain up as he leads Magnezone. Uh, we can just go right into Amoongus as he just goes right for the Volt Switch here. That looks to be choice specs, I think. Very possible uh, choice specs there. But we have an AV Magirna and we can just uh, go ahead and heal ourselves up. Uh, here, actually, what we can do is Volt Switch. As we can take the hit with AV pretty well, right? Volt switch out here into Kingdra. And then all we got to do is click Hurricane so that we can hit the Amoongus slot. Uh, yep, as he goes right into it. So Amoongus is going to get a little bit toasted there. I like that. Um, I feel like he'll switch out here. So we're going to go into um, Komo'o. As he goes into Togekiss here. Not the one I expected, actually. Because that would have got that would have been dead, right? <laughs> that would have been uh, destroyed. So we'll just go back uh, into Magirna, and then we can go right for the uh, Volt Switch here. I don't know if Marowak is Lightning Rod. Shouldn't be. Oh, it is Lightning Rod. Okay. So he is running one of those. Um, we get to go Como O here, I guess. So it does look like the Stealth Rocks will be quite nice. Um, I think I will... I think I'll get up Rocks. Because this Marowak... We, we can pressure this Marowak a bit. I'll U-turn out here now, because I feel like he'll switch, as he does, into Amoongus. Um, and then what we can do is we can go into Crawdont. A knockoff should uh, eliminate this Pokemon. Pretty sure it should eliminate it from existence. Yep, so that thing is gone, which means that he has no longer any water resists on his team. Uh, Rapid Striker Shifu, we have the Amoongus for this, um, as he will U-turn, so he'll get some chip. The chip is nice. I guess he does have this Pokemon as the... Uh, Another water resist, but it's not exactly a water resist because <laughs> it doesn't take two hits from Kingdra in in the rain. So that works there. We can actually... Yeah, he's going to probably knock himself out here, right? Um, I'll put just Fleur Cannon here. He'll knock himself out anyways. Um, then he's going to go into... Yep, Urshifu. We have Amoongus for that. As he'll asserting strikes, and he'll take the full effect of the helmet too, you already know. Um, that's nice. Then we can Spore here, but he goes Mandibuzz. Uh, let's think about this. I think I'll just go uh, Magirna. 
So he'll, he'll get the defog off, I guess. But a full health Marowak is not a problem anymore. Now that Amoongus is gone, Togekiss is gone, Urshifu is almost basically gone. And uh, yeah, it's kind of all we need. Actually, I'll go hard Kingdra here, I think is, is my play. I do like hard Kingdra in case he goes like Marowak or something. Or doubles. I, I don't even know. I, I feel like he'll just defog anyways. Because I, I just want to click flip turn. <laughs> I just want to flip turn and develop red. That's all, that's all I want to do. That's all I want to do here. Look at this. See? He'll defog. That's fine. Let's flip turn out. Flip turn. Yeah, I got the nice 9% chip in the Pelipper. See, that chip damage is going to come a long way. You'll, you'll see. Uh, okay. Ooh, he's actually kind of slow. Why is he that slow? Oh, Whirlwind, that's why. Negative priority. Alright, well then we get to click Liquidation with this thing and do a ton of damage. I'm running Liquidation over Crab Hammer, by the way. Due to the fact that, uh, while testing this team, I've missed about 10 or 11 or so crucial Crab Hammers. And, uh... Yeah, I just wanted a move that hits 100% of the time, so I went with Liquidation. Especially since, you know, we're not running it outside of rain, so the extra damage comes from the rain. Uh, like, for example, Jet knocks this out, probably. Yep. Um, GG. So, good game, overall. Um, got to showcase a little bit of flip turn on the Kingdra there. Um, but we'll definitely get more matchups where I think Kingdra is... Is, um... I guess, like, very, very useful. Like, Kingdra here, it could be useful. Um, he has Rillaboom, which is priority. Uh, that's why we have Amoongus as well. Amoongus just walls Rillaboom entirely, unless he's running, like, Acrobatics or something. Um, which, even then, we could still take a hit, clear Smug, uh, the, the uh, Grassy Seed or something, if he does have that. Uh, I feel like he'll just lead with, um, yeah, Lycanroc, maybe. I'll lead Magearna. Magirna lead on the Magirna lead. Okay, okay. So I think I'll Vol Switch here. If he's the Calm Mind Iron Defense set, if no, I think that's AV. All right, let's go Amoongus. Let's figure out what he is. You know, let's figure out. Yeah, he's he's AV. Okay, good, good. Because the Iron Defense Calm Mind sets that a lot of people have been running are extremely annoying. Like they're difficult sets to knock out. Let's uh. Go ahead and get that rain up real quick. And then go into Amoongus here, I think is fine. So the thing is, um, it's good information that Magirna is slow because I can use Kronon to actually obliterate it with a um, with a liquidation. So he's actually going to go Volcarona here, okay. Um, in that case, what we can do is go into... We could use Magirna to pivot into Crowdon so that we don't take a Bug Buzz full on. So he actually Fire Blasts here. Yeah, we take that really well, actually. I'll Volt out now. And we can Volt into Kingdra. Oh, he actually Quiver Dance is here. Hold up, hold up. Um, Yeah, we can still go Kingdra, I think. And just click Surf. Uh, we could Flip Turn as well into, well, I, I think Surf, Surf is still the best play. Because that does 43, which is fantastic. Uh, and then we can go Amoongus here. As he will Flirt Cannon. He is AV, right? So he will Volt Switch here. Um, so what we want to do is, well, we've already spored something. Maybe just a Gage Drain could be good, but could also actually go into Como O, double the Como O here. Um, as he'll Volt Switch out. Could get some rocks up, maybe. That might be nice. I definitely think rock, rock chip damage is going to be good. It'll put uh, probably the Magirna in range uh, of the uh, of the Surf damage. So he's going to go Rillaboom here. Um, I wonder why he went Rillaboom. Because I could just get rocks up here and then just Iron Defense myself. Oh, he has high horsepower. Okay. Well, at this point in time, so we got the Iron Defense up, we'll live the next hit, and Body Press plus Rocky Helmet should take out Rillaboom. So, he misses that, but we wouldn't have gotten knocked out anyways, and yeah, Body Press knocks it out, even without the Helmet, so... That is great. Uh, Halucha comes in now. 
Um, he does have a defense boost. So we want to weaken this thing as much as possible so that we can knock it out with Crowdon's uh, Aqua Jet. So heal Acro. We clutch survive. <laughs> That's the shout out to the Chinese EV spread there on this uh, Como O. In comes Azu next. Um, we can just click uh, EQ. Heal Aqua Jet so he'll get more chip. Uh, this is probably Belly Drum. I don't know if it's Belly Drum or not, but it could be uh, Belly Drum there. I think what we do now is. What do we do? So here what we could do is we could go into Amoongus. I'm trying to not like invite in Volcarona. Um, honestly, actually no, what we could do is go Magirna and Vol Switch. I think, that, I think that's a good play. Cause he, he can't belly drum. And then, yeah, of course he'll bring in Volcarona, but we get to uh, switch out here into Pelipper. And then go right for the uh, U-turn. We don't really need the rain turns a lot anymore now because everything's kind of just chipped down for Crawdont. So he'll Psychic, that's fine. Um, this lets us bring in uh, Kingdra. We can now just flip turn here, I think. Yeah, let's, let's trap him in the Vortex. Let's trap him in. Magirna comes out so we can flip turn on this. In the crowd, we go now and then hit him up with the, uh, let's see, probably, yeah, Liquidation, 100 accurate. So we get rid of that Pokemon, that's great. In comes Volk. Um, I have Aqua Jet on this thing, unless he's trying to stall out turns. Yeah, I guess he's trying to stall out turns or something, but... Um, can't really do that when you're knocking out, when Pokemon are getting knocked out left and right. Uh, then, yeah, in comes Azu. We have three turns of rain. What we can do is just liquidate. That destroys it entirely. So Kingdra Crowd on combination is quite fantastic. Both of them breaking down each wall that they are good against, respectively. Or each Pokemon that they're good against. Um, yeah, not bad. I feel like I've seen this team before. I think this is a uh, Finch team that Joey used on his channel, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I think I glanced at the sets a little bit. This is probably Specs Magear now with a very intricate EV spread. Uh, Golurk, which is AV trick with Klutz. Because that gets rid of the item effect of uh, being locked in. Um, what do we do? So I guess Pelipper lead seems fine here. As he does lead Magirna. This is definitely gonna Volt Switch though. So what we can do is go Amoongus. As he will Volt Switch here. Yep, yep. Uh, into who, I wonder? We'll find out. I don't remember what the Dragapult set was though. Uh, the Manda Buzz was decently fast. Faster than Crawdont though, but. Um, not, not Spadef, I think. Yeah, Amoongus comes in here. Um. I don't see what this is gonna is gonna do to me. Like, sure he'll do that. That's fine. I'll go coma or to regen. Block that. Um, I don't remember if this has court change or not, but I'm gonna go back to Amoongus here. He cannot spore me. Back into Como. Trying to find an opportunity. I'll, I'll get rocks up here, I think, is fine. So he can sleep out of this thing. That's good, though, because now he can't really um, put anything else to sleep, I guess. Stun Spore. Ooh, okay. So he's got the nice uh, para combination. So I'm going to go Como O now. Go right back into Pelipper. Or go out here into Pelipper. As he goes Golurk this time. Okay, that's good. That's very good. I could Scald this, I think. So he goes Mandibuzz here. Probably wants to Defog. But now, actually, this gives us the U-turn into, um, into Kingdra here. And then we can Hurricane. Although, yeah, I think Hurricane's fine. Yep, as he goes straight into Amoongus. This is not Spadef, I think. <laughs> it takes so much damage. That is amazing. Um, nice. And then I could just go right here into Magirna. 
Probably as he switches out into his own Magirna. Yep. We can Volt Switch out here. Although I guess he does have Golurk that he can go into. Yeah, which he does go into. Um, I know his Golurk has Poltergeist on it. I'm going to go Crawdon here, actually. As he Poltergeists. We, I think, should be faster than this thing. So I can liquidate. I hope we're faster than it, at least. You go straight into Mana Buzz. That thing's dead. Yep. That's a cooked Mana Buzz right there. Then he brings in Dragapult. We have a Megirna for this thing, I think. Should be kind of safe to go into. He'll U-turn into... Uh, yeah, Golurk. Where we can get a fresh set of Rain Up. So I think Rain is like pretty good right now. Um, especially since we got a bunch of Swift Swimmers that are good, some new moves like Flip Turn and stuff. Um, I'm going to go Pelipper here. As he will Poltergeist, and it does pretty good damage overall. Uh, I am just going to U-turn out here, though, into... I think Kingdra is fine. This Amoongus regenerated not much at all, actually. So let's go Kingdra and start uh, clicking Surf. So I do like the new Hurricane uh, move on this thing. I think it's really solid to deal with. A lot of the grass types that would have otherwise switched in on it. Last gen, you know, there was AV Tangrowth. Which was um, an ultimate uh, Kingdra switch in. But yeah, now he has to sack something, doesn't he? And I'm pretty sure that even from the range Amoongus is at, it dies to a Surf. So this thing, yeah, it's going to get to a KO'd here. So that's gone. Uh, Magirna is at 100%, so it will live this hit. Though I'm not sure what he, wanted, what he wants to do here. Yeah, he goes into Magirna. So our play is to go Amoongus, I think, this time. As he does Volt Switch here. I could have surfed too, but uh, there's no need right now, I think. Go Cinderace here. Okay, um, that's fine. This is Bulk Up. Does he have Zen? I can Iron Defense though, that's nice. Um, that does a ton. <laughs> but I think the second Iron Defense should allow us to live the next hit. So we can just Body Press here. Because now he becomes a Fighting type and then this thing is uh, getting severely weakened now. Which is great. So he'll Zen again. And he gets knocked out by the helmet. Beautiful. Cinderace is gone. That was kind of a threat. So he's got three mons left here, right? Um, we have Pelipper above 50, so we can get Rain up, and then we can afford to switch in one more time after. I'm going to go Magirna here. As he goes Golurk. Um, and then what we want to do is... Uh, let's see. So alternatively, we can sack Pelipper... I think we actually could sack Pelipper at this point in time. We don't ex we don't exactly need it. Although Rain is nice, but let's sack it. As he tries to Earthquake here, okay. Um, I'll defog. But he is actually faster. I really I really think that that Crawdon is faster than this thing. I don't think he's running max speed. Like I don't I don't think he is. So I'm gonna go Crawdon here. And liquidate this thing. Or even knockoff is good too. Um, no, but I'll, I'll liquidate here. As he goes hard into Amoongus, this thing should... Yep, get to a KO'd. Uh, but there is Helmet as well though. Can I can still liquidate again. And then, of course, we have the Fizdef Amoongus in the back. 
Uh, but he sacks Goldark here. Ooh. That's actually good. I think that's I think that's pretty good. Then we can go Kingdra. Hit him with the uh Ooh, this is a tough one. I want a hurricane badly, but I'm gonna surf here. Yep, make the play. And get do uh, a clean 76. So now he's forced to go back into Amoongus. Let's see how much this takes. Uh that's good damage. So I think now the play is definitely to um, surfing again. I don't think it's the play because he could spore me, right? And Magirna is at 24. But he has no way to hit Amoongus, my own Amoongus. Let's save this for maybe a hurricane and not put it to sleep. So let's go into Amoongus here. Yeah, as he tries to spore. Um, excellent, excellent. So he can sludge bomb. He gets a crit on me there. And then what we can do is go Magirna. As he puts this to sleep instead. Go right into Kingdra here. As he goes Magirna himself. We can Hurricane this turn, mm-hmm, knock out Amoongus, and then we win the game with, uh, yep, so we, we outplayed there, definitely outplayed there, and we can uh, just click Surf in the end now, so that's good, that was a good game, uh, for sure, yeah, that does so much damage, <laughs> that does so much, um, yeah, and then we can uh, bring in Kingdra here, Surf to win the game, and that shall be GG, it's Envy right there. Excellent game. So yeah, it's tough to switch into Kingdra if you don't have like a really good spidef wall. And now with Hurricane, you can easily outplay like different types of Pokemon. And uh, yeah, now it's looking like we have here... I feel like this team is looking a little bit weak to rain, right? Because, I mean, he does have Pharaoh, but uh, with Kingdra and Karana combined, I think that we're definitely going to have uh, an easier time than if he had some other Pokemon, like bulkier ones like Chansey. As I was saying, um, but yeah, let's uh, let's leave Pelipper. As he leaves Magnezone, we have Amoongus to switch into, which can be our nice little pivot into this Mon here. Um, and then I guess he's gonna go like Marowak or something. Offensively, he can only deal with it with his Fire types, but those are kind of weakened in the rain now. Uh, Amoongus is also amazing because he can deal with uh, Kelio pretty effectively too. So I do like that. All right, so he goes into Pharaoh here. Uh, and then what we can do is we can go right into uh, Komo -O on this thing. So he'll knock. And then what do we do then? Probably get rocks up here, right? I think rocks are pretty nice. Uh, but then we can also body press because if we weaken Pharaoh Thorn, that will be very, very nice for us. Um, though I'm not sure what he'd go into here. Because he doesn't really switch into this Pokemon well. Actually, I'll get rocks up here. I'll get rocks up. Because I don't know if he has Court Change or not. But even if he does, we if we get rocks up, we can still pressure the Marowak a bit. Because Marowak is still like his best switch into this thing. He'll T-Wave. Okay. Yellow Magic. It is. And I get Parrot too. And I get Parrot again. Like, what's wrong with this guy? Come on. <laughs> I guess he does have the Chopple still. I'll Earthquake now. As you probably go Marowak here. Or he goes Keldeo. So that, that works too, I guess. Yeah. Like, who am I kidding? Yeah, this went in like a full, like, 180 there. Very annoying. Uh, but we'll definitely defog, I think. Pharaoh's at 55, he has Chopple as well, so he can't heal himself up with leftovers. Uh, so that's okay, uh, I think it's pretty fine. Go Cinderace here, we have a Pelipper that we can go into. Uh, and we have Regen on Amoongus as well. So he does U-turn out. So there are still rocks up, so that's decent for the chip damage we need on him. He'll Volt here.
All I need is to get into uh, Kingdra safely, and then uh, can have some fun. Keldeo gets two Ikeo from this range too. I don't know why he went into it. Does he have something that I don't know about? Um, I could also Spore here. Um, oh, he'll flip turn to get more <laughs> helmet damage. Like, why? <laughs> why would you do that? I don't understand. Why, so you can go back to Ferrothorn and get more spikes up? You already have your three spikes. Yeah, okay, Ferrothorn. That's perfectly fine. I mean, he has knockoff, right? So what we can do is uh, we can go into Como-O as he knocks again. And just body press this for some damage. He literally has no switch in. Yeah, Rotom comes in. Okay, now what? You're going to Vol Switch? A Discharge? Okay. So then we got rid of Rotom. And uh, Electric Type, one of the Electric Types are gone. That's good. So then he goes Magnezone here. I assume he'll Volt Switch or something. I mean, Earthquake is my play. Either way, because we still we still live the hit. Pharaoh comes in at less than 50 now. That's That's good. Yeah, Pharaoh is, is definitely, uh, yeah. But we got rid of it now at least, so that's kind of the goal. And then we could, ooh, we could get the rain up. Fresh rain. Just the way I like it. So we can go Amoongus here. As he brings in Cinderace. Um, I don't think I need Amoongus anymore. Keldeo is weak enough to the point where... Probably don't need it. So let's just end his chain, end his momentum chain there. And then win the game with Kingdra. Yeah, he brings in Mag. Uh, I believe that uh, Kingdra can secure uh, the game for us, right? Pretty sure we can uh, just knock it out. I don't think he's AV, but I would assume he was... I don't know. I don't, know, I don't think he specs. It could be Scarf Magnezone too. That's another possibility, but I'm hoping that he cannot live this hit. Yeah, very good. So that thing is gone. And then he's got like two mons weak to jet as well. Keldeo comes in here. We can surf this. Don't need to switch. Mm-hmm, that's gone too. Kingdra, showcase, I like it. I'm glad I'm glad it's back too, because uh Kingdra was definitely one of my favorite Swift Swimmers back in the day as well. I used to run it a lot on uh on Rain back in like black and white. Actually I don't remember if it was banned or not, I forgot. But yeah, good game. So, yeah, it's a good team, I think, with uh, with Kingdra flip turn. Like, the flip turn is, is mainly useful for um, if they actually have a wall to Kingdra, but not, not a lot of teams that are, like, bulky, not, that aren't bulky, have uh, a good switch in. And for certain other switch ins, like, like the one that we've just played with um, Magirna and uh, Amoongus out playing that with Kingdra, like, they gotta watch out for those kind of uh, those plays uh, from, from Kingdra there that we actually did really well with. Um, so, that was nice. These guys rocking a Scyther team with Urshifu, so this will be an interesting one. Um, I think leading Pelipper is uh, still our move, as uh, it can do it can do some work, get the rain up and stuff. His team, I think, in particular, looks a little weaker to rain. So I'm hoping we can uh, get some more Kingdra action. As he does lead Magirna straight up. So we do have the Amoongus for that. Um, and he goes right for the Volswitch. So it looks like he's going to be AV. Looks definitely AV to me. So Scyther is a pretty big threat, actually. Um, but we do have Magirna that can kind of check it decently, sort of, right? Um, let's Volswitch here. As he will U-turn out. 
So you'll probably be heavy duty boots, which means that Scyther gets toasted in one hit probably. Uh, because this thing is AV, I want to go into Crowdont. I think Crowdont will be faster. And we can just go right for the liquidation. As it goes right into Coma O, this is going to do a ton of damage. Or kind of. Not much. Um, yeah, it's... It's alright. We can go here into Kingdra. As it gets up rocks, and I can just uh, click Surf. So we can get some chip damage on the Magirna. Although I do want to click Hurricane. But I think Surf is still the better play. Yeah, Surf is the better play. Ooh, that does enough damage to knock it out. Wait a second there. <laughs> Hold up, that thing is gone. Dragapult comes in. We have a Magirna for that. As he drops a Draco, nice, nice. We can now click uh, Volt Switch here as he goes Cinderace. Beautiful. And then go right into um, into Pelipper here. For which we can uh, just defog or U-turn ourselves. I think U-turn is fine here. Uh, I see we'll bulk up, but... Um, it's a plus one knockout Kingdra. I don't know. Um, hmm. Let's go Kingdra. Doesn't knock us out. Okay. No, we had more bulk than I thought we did. So that's good. Um, Dragapult comes in now. We get to go uh, probably back into Magirna here. Yeah, back into Magirna. As he will Shadow Ball this turn. Um, and we can freely Flur Cannon here. He doesn't have a switch in. And everything seems to get knocked out by this. Yeah, Como is going to get knocked out here. That's good. Oh. Wow. <laughs> That is not good. That is not good at all. So we would have gotten a free knockout there, but that's why I hate 90 accurate moves because that's how like I imagine imagine missing Fleur Cannon just like Crab Hammer. Crab Hammer is also 90 accuracy. Imagine missing Fleur Cannon, but like more than 10 times in the span of like an hour or less. I don't know, um, but yeah, we put this to sleep and then we can go into. Oh, there's one turn of rain left. Um. Yeah, Como -O maybe can work. Like, I don't really need rocks though, but. I feel like a dual wing beat will probably knock us out, but I think. Uh, let's just get the rain up. We'll get the rain up here, as he will dual wing beat. That doesn't knock us out yet, but it will now. Then we go into uh, Kingdra. I think at this point we can lock ourselves in a hurricane. He'll sack Como, -O, go into Dragapult. Um, he's not going to Urshifu. I wonder why. Can Magirna? Magirna how much, took how much? Let's see. Fifteen. Yeah, we'll we'll live. I think after a round of rocks, fifteen or so. So let's go Magirna. He will Draco. That does not work on us. We can Fleur Cannon here as he'll sack our Shifu. So that's good. Brings back in Dragapult here. Okay. That's not gonna. That's not gonna work. I think. <laughs> not today. Not today. Yeah. And then last is gonna be um, Scyther. So we can Volt Switch here. He'll uh, dual wing beat, which will be enough to knock us out. But then we have Kingdra in the back here. Let's click the new hurt. Let's click the new move, Hurricane. <laughs> Finish this thing off. And then with that, I think we can get maybe one more for this one. Um, we've been putting in a lot of work with this team, so I'm I'm liking that. Uh, we'll end it off here. This last team, he's rocking a Sun team um, with Drill. Uh, okay. So we got our work cut out for us in this one, Weather War. Uh, I will just click uh, Scald here, but he actually goes hard Torkoal. So that's pretty interesting. I can U-turn into uh, Como, I think, is the play. 
Let's see, we'll click rocks here, and then I can just, um, I can get my own rocks up, or, no, he's gonna go Togekiss, so I'm actually gonna go Pelipper to get the rain back up, then go Magirna. As you will air slash, we can Aura Sphere to predict either Drill or I guess Torkoal as a mid ground. We can hit this thing up, that's good. <laughs> Got some nice damage there. Um, and then I guess go Como O here. As he will Earthquake, but that's fine. Um, I do want rocks up, but I don't think I need them, so I'll just attack that. So I don't know if Torkoal is heavy duty boots or not. So the extra rock chip might be worth it. If this was his spinner, I could actually get up rocks. Uh, could get up rocks if he brings it in. He brings in Cinderace though. Okay, so he'll probably Zen head, but here, no, he just straight up high jump kicks. Okay, um, that this means Kingdra can come in now, uh, and we're free to click Surf because he has to go into. Torkoal if he wants to survive or if he wants to get sun up and that's gone like that <laughs> I don't know I don't think he would have lived it anyways but you know uh, nice so unless this thing has like sunny day or something we're good so we get the rain up here he's just gonna growth um, we can now switch out into Magirna as he will sludge bomb that doesn't work we can volt here as he weather balls into uh, Kingdra Lock ourselves in a hurricane now. Yup. You love to see it. Togekiss, we get to go into Magirna. Yeah, GG. And uh, with that, I think um, we're a little bit under time right now, so I want to get over that 40 minute mark. So why don't we just uh, finish this game up with, uh, with one more uh, game here. And that's going to be against a Rillaboom squad. With uh, with Necrozma and stuff, so he does have the Glaring Wheezing, which might have uh, neutralizing gas. Could be a little bit annoying for uh, for Kingdra and stuff for Swift Swim, but or actually, um, I don't know, maybe maybe for like Regen Amoongus or something too. Uh, we'll lead Pelipper, as he does lead Necrozma, and I definitely want to switch out immediately. Uh, we're gonna go Magirna here, since uh, Avian Magirna in the rain can definitely deal with this Necrozma, and he's already burned up his. Uh, his power herb with meteor beam so that's good um, I don't think he'll switch out either so we're gonna just flare cannon he'll photon this shouldn't do much either yeah it is 18 uh, I've missed more flare cannons than I can count like that's also one of the reasons why I really don't like cinderace <laughs> see look we would have gotten damage on that on the uh, necrozma there but it is what it is he does trick here Gives us a uh, choice scarf. Um, honestly, I wouldn't mind getting up my rocks. As he'll pain split, and we still have rain up. I'm gonna go Amoongus here, just because uh, I can still take the hit. I, I feel like he'll just voltage anyways. I can take an overheat in the rain too. He actually goes into Krasma, so we are gonna switch into Magirna. As he will photon. And then here we can just uh, Volt switch out. Volt is the play, Volt is the way. He's going to be taking rocks damage too, so that's nice. Um, and then we can go into Kingdra here. As Rain does wear off on the wrong turn. Um, if he Choice Scarf, he's max speed, right? I'll go Como O. Uh, as he goes Rillaboom here. Which means that we can lock ourselves in a Body Press now. And that's doing a decent chunk as well. He's going to SD up, but I mean, I don't really think there's much he can do. I mean, we also have an Amoongus as well. <laughs> it just destroyed immediately. I liked it. As I was talking, I just saw that thing go dis get destroyed. <laughs> that's hilarious. Uh, okay. Amoongus is in next. Uh, I assume, I don't know if this is Belly Drum or not, but... Uh, if it is Belly Drum, what I would want to do is probably, uh, I have to go Pelipper or Sack something then, right? Um, so I think the play is going Pelipper. So that, I mean, obviously he will Belly Drum. Um, 
I want to say that a hurricane might knock it out from this range. But I think we need some we need some chip. We need some rocket helmet chip. I think we need that rocket helmet chip. I feel like this is the dark fighting one, so Amoongus in this match might not be the best, right? Let's go into Amoongus here. He's gonna knock. This should put it in range of um of the uh, hurricane, I think, from a specs Kingdra. So we're gonna hurricane this. Hopefully, hopefully it'll knock it out. Jet's not a 2 KO either, so that's good. Um, yeah, and it does knock it out, so fantastic. Uh, we got out of that situation pretty nicely. He's going to go Necrozma here. We get to go into Magirna. And then, uh, yep, he will Photon here. We can just uh, Volt Switch out as he Heat Waves, so that does barely any more damage. And then King Drag gets to come in now. Click that Surf. Um, don't even need to flip turn here either. Flip turn's good. It's like very situational though, but um, we don't even need to go for it right now. We can just click that attack right in front of us. Uh, Urshifu comes in. This is going to be Sucker Punch, which will probably knock us out. So I'm going to go Komo. As he Wicked Blows here, actually. Okay, not bad. Um, I really do want to double... I really want to double so badly. Yeah. And now I can actually click flip turn again. <laughs> I can finally click that flip turn. I wonder if uh, he shouldn't be uh, neutralizing gas, right? If he is, then my rain won't be set, I think. Oh, it is set. Never mind. I don't know if it works that way, though. Uh, I can U turn out here. Um, we are faster than it, though. Um, we'll go Magirna. Let's heal Strange Steam again. I don't think I'm faster than this, am I? Probably not. Goes Rotom. Beautiful. Kingdra, come back. Let's knock this out with a flip turn. <laughs> I want to knock this out with a flip turn real quick. Yeah, I like that. Got the Oko with the flip turn. Then we get to go Crawdont here which will invite in the Urshifu. And uh, honestly, I don't mind just uh, clicking Liquidation. He'll close combat, that's fine. Um, we can just go into Komo-O now. And body press this. As he'll go Weezing. Um, that, in, that lets us bring in Magirna. As he will strange steam. And then Poison Fairy. I could just Iron Head here. Or actually Vol Switch is the better play. Vol Switch is the is the better play because um I think even now, like from a Specs Kingdra that's not in the rain, I'm pretty sure we knock it out with uh with the surf either way. Like I'm pretty sure we knock it out. Yeah, not bad. Then comes our Shifu once again. Um, honestly, we don't need to be faster because he... Well, actually, he should have Sucker Punch because he's Life Orb. So we're just going to stay in anyways. As he will Sucker Punch. And then we can knock it out with the Body Press from Choice Scarf Como -O now. Because he was so nice and gave us the Choice Scarf there. And that is going to be GG. So thank you everybody for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this video. And seeing uh, Kingdra doing some flip turns here and there. Doing some Hurricanes. We made some pretty good plays, I think, overall, and uh, the team is pretty solid, so feel free to try it out. And once again, leave a comment and tell me, if you were going to change something in Pokemon, what would it be? I'm very curious to hear from all of you, and um, yeah, I do appreciate all the support, and it's, it's time, you know, we got to outplay the algorithm every single time. So, I'll see you all on the next video, and peace.